minor league baseball now on the Ladies show as our road trip makes a stop in the double-a Texas League tonight we get the week started with the first of four between the Corpus Christi hooks and the Springfield Cardinals now batting Brian De La Cruz and we are set for baseball here this evening The one two game time temperature tonight a comfortable 66 degrees at first pitch. He'll try again one two. two, ball, two and a good pitch there is this is swung on and missed for the first out of the ball game. Ready now, Gray Kessinger. And he's carrying a batting average of just over 300. So clearly he's been a productive player with the bat in his hand so far. Lofted in the air out toward right center. And he will make the play out there, and there are two away now. Stepping into the box, Chucky Robinson. And you see the numbers there. He's been very dangerous at the plate, to say the least. A shin high slider and laid off for a ball. Seared down the first baseline. Fielded cleanly, and he'll step on the bag himself, and the inning is over. Now with the play, Kramer Robertson. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Belted high in the air out to left. Left fielder looking up at the track. The wall. Gone! Standing in now, Lars Newtbar. Outside, two and one. And he can't catch the corner here, so he's behind three and one. Well, we all know he's not the greatest threat with the bat up there. His numbers certainly aren't that pretty. But, hey, I give him credit. He's really working the count right here. The 3-2 pitch is at the knees and called strike three. Now in the box, Ryan Blanchard comes in after a day of rest yesterday. So we'll see if it did him any good. Hit the other way out toward right field. De La Cruz is there. Two down. Digging in. Jerry Gonzalez. Looking to get on base and keep this first inning alive. 1-1. There's a fastball taken high for a ball. Two out. Nobody on. Fastball is looked at for strike two. A hey, nice job of bouncing back after the leadoff homer. Two quick outs after the bomb, and he's got a chance to get out of this. Fastball didn't miss by much, and it's a full count now. Three and two. Late on that one as it's fouled off to the left side. The next three, two. This is line to left. That gets down, and the inning continues. At the plate now, Connor Capel. Look out, that one almost got away from him. Two and two now. And now a curveball as he's got to lean out of the way. That one nearly got him. Three, two, two out, runner on first. Lots of possible outcomes on this pitch. Pulled high in the air out to right field. De La Cruz is going to have room out there as he puts this away to retire the side. Leading off the inning, J.J. Matajevic, and they'll need him to get something going here. He's set. Here comes the 1-1. One -one.
In the dirt, but swung on and missed. The throw down to first, one away. Digging in, Colton Shaver. He enters play, hitting down in the 240s for the year. One out, nobody on. And he finds a way to catch the zone here. It's one and two. And he lays off a pitch outside as they draw even at two and two. Here's the pitch. Now a swing and a miss. Maybe even a foul tip, but it's held onto behind the plate for out number two. The left fielder. Into the box, Corey Jones. And he's carrying a batting average of just over 300. So clearly he's been a productive player with the bat in his hand so far. Still two and two. And it's fouled away. Trying to strike out the side. Here it is. Smoke toward third. Right to him. Throw on to first. Gets him and the side is retired. half of the second set to go set to get his evening at the plate started Nolan Gorman batting just a notch below 300 so far on the season ground ball sent back up the middle scooped up and the throw here is in time very nicely done there at short for the first down at the plate Brian O'Keefe the season batting average comes in down in the 240s Here's a breaking ball, but it doesn't quite find the strike zone. On oh, a good pitch there, had him stretching to get out there, and it's two and two now. Well, that was an ugly swing. If I'm pitching right now, I'm throwing that same pitch again. That was ugly. This is skied into short left center. Jokes comes on and makes the catch in shallow left for out number two. Stepping into the box, Irving Lopez will try to make something happen with two gone in the bottom of the second. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. Bases are empty here with two men out. This is on the ground over to first. He's got it. Off balance throw gets him. Nice play there as the side is retired. In now, Carmen Benedetti, as we are all set to begin the third inning in this one. Swing and a little blooper to center. Center fielder coming on. That's a base hit, their first of the game. Batting it. The second baseman, Jeremy Pena. To the plate now, Jeremy Pena. Line drive to left. And that'll get down for a base hit. Batting up. The center fielder, number four, Alex McKenna. Stepping in now, Alex McKenna. This one's outside. Quite a bit off the plate that time. I don't blame him for not coming over the heart of the plate. He circled this guy on the lineup card when he got to the yard today. He's been swinging one of the hotter bats in the game. The second for one. On to first, and they get them both. So striding in, Brian De La Cruz, as he's got a chance to tie this ball game up with that equalizing run just 90 feet away at third. And here's a slider for a called strike, and he's behind one and two now. And this is swung on and missed. Might have even been a foul tip that's held on to, but either way, the side is retired. Yeah. 
Striding forward now is the DH, Zach Kirtley. He was one for four with a two-bagger in yesterday's game. Grounded to third. And there's one down now. Trying to pick things up where we left off. Kramer Robertson. He went deep in his first at bat. We'll see what he's got in store for us here. And that's been the entire offense so far in this one. They've been shut down other than that. Two and one to count. Now here it comes. Can't find the zone there, and it's three and one. Inside, he misses ball four. Digging in to try it again. Now Lars Nootbaar, ball for one after he took a look at strike three in his first plate appearance. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the one, two. There's a fastball well off the plate for a ball. A great pitch there as he couldn't get extended on that one, and he's down on strikes for the second out. Now right fielder. Stepping up to the plate, oh, yeah. Ryan Blanchard. He flew out in his last at bat. Now the one and one pitch. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. McKenna is under it and he makes the catch for out number three. Coming to the plate now, Gray Kessinger comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. set and the payoff pitch lifted in the air out to left Newt Bar is there and he has it for the out now striding in Chucky yep. Robinson Chucky. he got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time lofted in the air out toward right center Lopez onto the grass and this is into the alley and ought to be good for extra bases not in time and he's in there with a double the first baseman number 23 J.J. Matajeve at the plate J.J. Matajeve hit in the air to right center field this ball is carrying well back it goes and it is out of here Into the box, Colton Shaver lays off two and two now. Still only one out in the inning. Fastball, strike three called as he couldn't pull the trigger, and there are two away. The left fielder of the three. Digging in now, Corey Jokes. Ball and two strikes. Here it is. Two and two. Count remains two and two. Lucky he got a piece right there. He was definitely late on that pitch after seeing a previous off-speed pitch. And he fouls this one off. Line drive to left. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away, and that ends the inning. Leading off the inning, Jerry o Gonzalez, as they'll look to get something going here and even this game up. And that misses for ball four. It's a leadoff walk that starts the bottom of the fourth. Settling in now, Connor Capel. So far, 0 for 1 with a flyout. Here's the 1 1. This one's down to third. And that is through into left field, the base hit. Onto the shortstop, but thrown away. The batter, the third baseman, no way. Into the box now, Nolan Gorman. 
And he lays off the curveball. Strike three called. And that's going to be out number one. The catcher. So oh, stepping yeah. in, Brian O'Keefe. Oh, yes, he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. Lifted in the air to shallow center field. Long run for the center fielder. Oh, and this deflects right off him. And a good throw is going to hold that runner at third. So they're loaded now with only one away. Standing in now, Irving Lopez. Breaking ball there is down. Good job of laying off. It's back to two and two. And this is on the ground to short. Could be two. There's one. Back to first. And that was a sparkler. A double play. And the inning is over. Ready to go in the top of the fifth. Next will be the designated hitter, Carmen Benedetti. One for one after a single this first time up. The 3 1. Finds the zone to fill the count, three and two. Too close for comfort, and he did a good job just to make contact. Another full count pitch home. Line drive to center field. Capel is there and he has it for the first out. So coming to the plate, Jeremy Pena. A base hit in his first trip. Hit out towards second. Fielded cleanly. Pro gets him two down. Stepping in, Alex McKenna. Both for one for him here in this one. McKenna. The one-one home. And he turns this one around high and deep to center field. But that'll stay in the park as it's off the wall. And he'll coast into second here with a two out double. The right fielder, number 15, Brian De La Cruz. In now, Brian De La Cruz lofted in the air out toward right center. Right fielder is on the run. He can't get there, so the inning will continue. And that's going to plate the runner from second as this is now a three to one ball game. Now batting. Flip Gray Kessinger. To the plate now. Gray Kessinger. Lined but speared on a hop. Throw to first will get him easily and the side is retired. Set now for the bottom of the fifth. Digging in for his second at bat, Zach Kirtley. The 1 1 home. This is in the air out to right field. Right fielder is on the run. He makes the catch. A great effort to get there and record the first out of the inning. Now at the plate, Kramer Robertson. He launched one over the wall back in the opening frame. Three to one our score as we play inning number five. And that's high and off the plate. Two and one. And he just misses inside with the fastball there. Now here's a check swing and they appeal down to first. No swing. So that's ball four. Striding into the box, the Lars Nootbaar. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Ready to deal. Here's the 2 1. Line drive, base hit to right. And they won't even attempt to run on that arm in right. So despite the runner moving on the pitch, it will wind up first and second here. So now to the plate, Ryan Blanchard. Ah, had him fooled as he swings through the curveball. Two down. Next will be the cleanup hitter, Jerry Gonzalez. It was a walk in his last trip. 
This is pulled into right. But a little unlucky there as it's hit right to him in right field for the final out of the inning. Digging in and looking for more, Chucky Robinson. One for two with a double on the ledger so far. The 2 1 home is swung on and missed for strike number two. Not too many guys taking a mound today with this good a split. Look at the downward action on that thing. It's fallen off the table. This one sinks low and a touch outside. It's a full count, three and two. What a great battle to start this inning. What a great job by the leadoff hitter. He knows that this pitcher's starting to get up there in pitches. The manager's starting to get restless. Let's see if we can knock him out and get into that bullpen. So he sets him down swinging. Chucky Robinson becomes the first out of the inning. Lifted the other way down the left field line. Left fielder giving chase. And he makes the catch in the corner. So digging in now, Colton Shaver, 0 for 2 on his line thus far. Shaver. Now the one and one pitch takes a pitch for strike number two. We're in the sixth inning here in a three to one ball game. Fastball laid off well below the knees. The 2 2 is looked at and the count moves full. And this one misses high for ball four, and they have themselves a two out base runner. Stepping in, Corey Jokes. Third trip to the plate for him here tonight. 0 for 2 at this point. He's set. Here comes the 1 1. Fly ball right down the line and left. Left fielder is on the move. He dives, but he can't make the catch. It's a foul ball. The one two to short. And as it turns out, the two out walk doesn't come around to haunt him as that ends the inning. Carlos Sanabria enters to do the pitching in the bottom of the sixth. Number 53, Carlos. Bottom of the inning now. Ready once again, Connor Capel. He singled his last time up. The 1-1. One, one. Pulled toward right center field. Center fielder on the run. He gets there to make the play for the first out of the inning. At the plate, Nolan Gorman. It was a backwards K, a strikeout looking for him in his last Nolan at bat. Yeah, Matty, and hopefully he got it out of his system. Especially now, he's got to bear down. He gets the two strikes in this spot, has to put the ball in play. He's fallen behind now, three and one. Brian O'Keefe waits on deck. Line toward the gap in left center. And that's in for a base hit. Make it a one for three game so far. Now that the captain. Into the box. Brian O'Keefe. Swing and a line drive. Foul. Hoping to send him packing. Pitch on its way. And now a slider in there for a called third strike. And there are two gone now. Ready for another shot now. Proving Lopez. He was a double play victim last time around. Yeah, rolling into a two ball will eat at you for the rest of the game at least. So you know he wants to make up for it right here. Bullet back up the middle. And he will get there to make the running play. And that will end the inning. Ronnie Williams is on to pitch from the bullpen now to start inning number seven. Number seven. Ronnie. Riding in once again, Carmen Benedetti. A hit in two tries so far.
hard liner to center field. Capel is right there, one down. Digging in now once back. again, Jeremy Pena, one for two. Jeremy. He singled and grounded out so far. Now the 2 1. Every base runner in a close game like this really matters, so you can't afford to be giving out free passes this late. And the count will be full. Into the windup, ready with the payoff pitch. Grounder down the line at third. Reined in. And an off balance throw is in time as he takes one away. Wow. Stepping up now, Alex McKenna. He doubled earlier in the game, one for two to this point. One and one, here it comes. We're in the seventh inning with a good finish brewing, three to one our score. Fastball didn't miss by much, and it's a full count now, three and two. Well, all of the umpires in the seats thought that would strike three, and they weren't far off, but I think that was a good call. Looked to be just a bit outside. Now batter, right fielder, Brian. At the plate now, Brian De La Cruz. This is in the air out to right. Blanchard is there, and he'll make the catch to retire the side. Gabriel Valdez gets the call from the pen to take over on the mound and start the home seventh. Number 63. Last half of the seventh here. Into the box now. Zach Kirtley. He's hitless in his two at bats so far. Even though we're moving into the back end of this game, they're only down by a couple of runs. You know that old slogan, a bloop and a blast. They could certainly use that right now. Liner toward right center. And that finds some outfield grass. It's a base hit. At the plate, Kramer Robertson. And he takes ball two, and it's two and one. Two and two the count. It's going to be back to some serious T work if he can't put that pitch in play right in his wheelhouse. And another foul ball. Pulled high in the air out to left field. Jokes will settle under it to make the play for the first out as the runner will have to head back to first. Stepping in and ready for another shot, Lars Newtbar. He's got a hit in three at bats to this point. Here's the one and two delivery. Oh, it's on the ground to second. Did he get his double play? To second for one. Relay throw, but it'll be too late as he's well safe at first. Now batting. Right Coming to the plate now, Ryan Blanchard. No hits in three tries so far. He struck out once. One and two as he chases the slider. And the inning goes away in unceremonious fashion on a swing and a miss at a ball way outside the strike zone. Into the box now, Gray Kessinger. He's hitless in three at-bats to this point. 3-2 pitch. Is a wave and a miss. He struck him out. Now to the plate, Chucky Robinson. Now he went down on strikes last time up. Chucky Robinson. Broken bat as this ball's hit on the ground. And there are two away now. So here's the cleanup hitter, J.J. Matajev. He's working on for three thus far. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Count even at two and two. 
hits her even at seven apiece. And this one runs in on him as he can't get his arms extended. A great pitch there, and the inning is over. Kit Sheets is on to pitch out of the bullpen in the bottom half of the eighth. Number 40, Kit Digging in the switch hitter, Jerry Gonzalez. He lined out in his last trip, so looking for better fortunes here. Yeah, Matty, but as he walks to the plate right here, he feels good building off that last A.B. He hit that ball on the screws. So he ran the fastball by him for the punch out. Jerry Gonzalez is retired leading off the bottom of the eighth. Sent on the ground out to second. And there's out number two. So striding forward now, Nolan Gorman. He steps in off a base hit in his last at bat. The 2 2. Now a swing and a softly hit ground ball. Throw to first in plenty of time, and the side is retired. Ready for another chance. Colton Shaver. It was a walk in his last trip. The 1-1 home. Hit back up the middle. And a diving effort there, but it'll come up empty. It's a base hit. Now back. Corey Jolks. Stepping in now. Corey Jolks. Oh, it's on the ground to second. Did he get his double play? One there. Throw on to first. Won't be in time, so they just get the one there. Now with the play, Carmen Benedetti. Hit the ball pretty well in his last at-bat, but it resulted in a line-out. Yeah, pretty unlucky right there, Matty. Squared up the fastball nicely, and that's all you can do. And hold on there. That's not going to get him in there with the stolen base. Now the 2-1. Will not catch the zone. Ball three. One out and a runner on second base. And that misses ball four. So with one out, that'll at least set up the double play possibility here that could get them out of the inning. Jeremy Pena. The one two. Misses ball two. He went with the off speed there once he got him to 0-2, but now that they both missed, I think we'll see more of a challenge pitch here. You don't have to give in, but you can't be too cute either. Got him swinging. Chased it well out of the zone, and there are two gone. Alec Jones on second. Benedetti at first, two out in the inning. A ball and two strikes now. Might have been taking all the way right there. That pitch couldn't have split the strike zone any better. And you can bet he wants that one back at the plate. Into the corner and slicing foul. The one two he is offered at and missed. He chased it for strike three. Ralph Garza, if the man called on to close this one and earn a save in the ninth. Number 72, Ralph. All set for the bottom of the ninth. At the plate, Brian O'Keefe. He got called out on strikes his last time through. Yeah, in today's game, certainly don't get completely reprimanded for too many strikeouts, but no one likes to go down looking. Expect him to be a little bit more aggressive at the dish this A.B. Fouled off. And that is the start they were looking for down by two as that misses for ball four. Now with the plate proving Lopez. We could really use a knock here 0 for 3 in the game so far. Fouled away. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. You know, something to keep in mind. They're really burning through that bullpen, and this is only the first game of the series. Definitely could have an impact on the rest of the series, and maybe even the whole week ahead. Full count now. And the payoff pitch. 
down the third baseline. And a diving effort there at third. Good way to bruise your ribs. How much for one of them ribs? It's a foul ball. Pulled toward right center field. De La Cruz has the best view of this one, so he'll take it for the first down. Digging in, Zach Kirtley. Last time through was a base hit. Runner at first here, one man out. And a half swing here, but he pretty clearly went around, and it's one and two now. That misses, and we're even at two and two. So you'd love for him to offer at that one, but the execution was flawless. Nice curveball that starts in the zone and breaks just out. Just a great take by the batter. Full count still. The next 3-2. Hit hard to the right side. There's one. On to first, and he rolls a double play ball to end it here as this ball game is over. Yeah, and they end this thing with style, turning that double play to preserve the win. That's what we call finishing strong. Tonight's ball game comes to a close. Three to one, the final. The Hooks took the lead in the fourth and held on until the end. Christian Javier earns his first win of the season. Ralph Garza wraps it up for the save, his fifth of the year. So that's a wrap for us here tonight. For my partners in the booth, Mark DeRosa and Dan Plezak and our entire crew, I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. And for more, click over to theshownation.com. Our final line score first for the victorious hook three runs on eight hits, no errors. They left six men on base for Springfield. One run, seven hits, no errors. They left ten men on base. Time of the ball game two hours and 33 minutes. Thank you for joining us here tonight, and we remind you to please drive home safely.